on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And what we've got on the menu is potentially absorbing league action. Stuart, how do you see this one going? Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Just the challenge that was required. Oh, good-looking run. Can he finish? Not out of the woods yet. And stopping the danger. Well, what a chance that was to take the lead. But you have to give the goalkeeper credit. What a brilliant save that was. Oh, opportunity here, Stuart. And the keeper showing tremendous command. Well, the referee took note of the earlier incident and now issues the yellow card. Trying to pick out a teammate. And still dangerous. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Well, the crowd are driving their team on here. They're surely going to score soon. Well, they get the ball once more. And that's a long way from the cross they were looking for. And a useful cross. That ball was put into the right area, but no one able to capitalise. Well, pressing really high. Well, out of play. Under pressure. Well, standing off them here, are they being too passive? And scope for them to produce something exciting. Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. Well, punched clear. Well, making considerable progress with the ball. Magnificent defending. And he was in the right place to intercept. Well, as you can see, the visitors have controlled the possession in the last 15 minutes and have played some really lovely football going forward. But they must now make it count and get themselves in front. Indeed, perhaps they can cash in again. Let's see. And space to cross it. Well, straight at the goalkeeper then. And showing the importance of wit. What a magnificent pass. But no, just offside. Well, it was close, and it is offside. The assistant got that absolutely right. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. And there it is, the half-time whistle. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Over the touchline for a throw-in. Lucas Possignolo. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. And take it away. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. 
Happy to take on the shot and putting his body on the line. And a very good challenge. Throw ins given. And a substitution in the offing. Intelligent threaded pass here. Can he finish? In it goes! The opening goal in this contest! Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Kouassi, determined defending. Well, possibilities inside the box. And you need your defender to take charge. Fifteen minutes left for play. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. On the cusp of the final whistle, and they're making home advantage count, but only just. Stuart, your thoughts? Yeah, just about edging it overall. It's been a really tight game, hasn't it? Chances at a premium, and you have to praise their defending in that regard. Just got to see out the final few minutes now. No silly mistakes at the back. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Well, it's a constant struck. And there it is, the final whistle. The home. It was a really...